Good morning, good morning. Let's visit a part of Sanibel that feels like you are stepping back in time. This area is rich in history and overlooks the magnificent San Carlos Bay. This area is called Woodring Point. Travel down Dixie Beach Boulevard all the way to the end. Look to your left and you will see a single dirt road. This is Woodring Road. In 1888, Sam Woodring and his wife Anna homesteaded 160 acres in this area. Records show that their daughter, Flora Sanibel Woodring, was the first white child born on Sanibel. Sam and Anna also had a son named Sam Jr. After Sam Sr. passed away, Sam Jr. took over the homestead. Sam Jr. married Esperanza, and they started a very popular fishing guide business. Esperanza was born on Cayo Costa, a small island north of Upper Captiva. After Sam Jr. passed away in 1942, Esperanza continued their fishing guide business. She took on all the additional work whilst raising two children. It is said Esperanza could throw a cast net like a champ and was well respected for her knowledge of the local waters. She carried on the business into the 80s. She died in 1992. Looking from behind Wood Ring Road, you see the blue waters of San Carlos Bay. In the foreground is Ladyfinger Lake. And as we come around, the big body of water ahead is Tarpon Bay. Members of the Woodring family still reside on Woodring Road. A section of the point was acquired by the Ding Darling Wildlife Preserve in 2013, and the Woodring family will live there with a life lease. I hope you've enjoyed this look at Woodring Road. My name is Nick Adams. Come back and join us on the next one.